So good afternoon. No, so um second quarter na gyud. So sa mga walay module, ang ato ang module is ana uh, TVM service quarter 2 module 1 set network configuration. Okay. So Kanisha is about um pagbutang og mga IP address sa server and client no pag configure og um internet connection no which is magamit siya sa inyong assessment pod no so magulat lang ta sa advice kung mo balik nang face to face possible na ay assessment so katong mga na libre og um tawag ni libre og assessment no katong training pero sa tanan man to ma-appeal man sa training no so magulat tag face to face para mas guapo no kay lisod man god pag dili ni actual no ang ato ang CSS is more on actual okay so Sige, what I know, okay. What I need to know, so, Kanisha is about LO2 or Learning of Outcomes to set up computer uh, network configuration. So, kung sa bang buhaton? First, check network connectivity of each terminal and accordance with network design. Next, diagnose and repair any problem of fault in the network system in line with the standard of operating procedure. Three, configure network interface card or NIC in accordance with network design. Next is carry out communication check between terminals in accordance with operating system network configuration. And the last is respond to unplanned events and or condition in accordance with establishment procedure. So in addition, after going through this module, you are expected to first configure peer-to-peer -peer network. Then share folders and printer inspect network configuration and diagnose network problems okay kanisha is a uh, crucial part ni sa assessment no okay kung masipyat lang ka og hatag og ip address or maon lang nimo ang firewall na tendency dili na siya mag ping okay so dire gyud ta mag focus okay in your module natay what i know so what I know is all about um, ano uh, stock knowledge no? or pre-test. So we have 15 items. Okay. Then the next is what's in. No? Activity 1.1, word association. So what words come into your mind when you hear the word configuration? Sige daw be configuration is about kanang ano ba mag configure o computer or mag set up o computer so mo na siya mag ayos o mag ayos no configuration okay so next is what's new in your module what's new so activity 1.3 basic network problems and troubleshooting tools so kani siya sa description unsa ang kani is Ano siya, scenario or problem. So, sa ano, next, sa first column or first uh, column, nadi ha, pilihan lang yung diri kung sa inyong answer. Okay? Next is activity 1.4. Steps on how to configure static IP address in Windows 7. So, na ato ganina, buntagi upload na ko sa channel no sa YouTube no steps in configure IP address so fill in the blank the answer na lang ninyo na activity 1.5 same no steps on how to configure home group in Windows 7 
Okay, next is what is it? So this is um tawag ani proper lesson, no? So lesson proper. Okay. So naadri tanan so how to configure IP address in Windows 7 network configuration. No? So mo na. Okay. How to share file and folders. Then, what's more, configure an internet I, network and use DHCP. Okay. So, nine mga steps. So, what I have learned, activity 1.10, 1. sum it up. No more summary. Then, what I can do, activity 1.12. Think it deeper with the heart. Okay, answer the questions. So, uh, all the, uh, ano, ang inyo ha mga answer is ibutang lang sa yellow pad. Okay? Then, last is the assessment. So, formative test, multiple uh, matching type. Then, items. Then, multiple choice, five items. Additional activities, research, different way of sharing network resources with following consideration. Operating system version, network adapter. Okay. So, research na isulat lang sa yellow pad tanan. Okay. So, muna ang walkthrough sa ito ang module. So, ato na ta sa ito ang topic for today. Okay. So, our first topic is about internet protocols or the IP. No? So, dili ni siya IPs na indigenous, no? kundi IP internet protocols. Okay, sa computer na siya. Kung sa computer, ang kaning IP address is mura ni siya address sa imuhang computer. So, kung maghay mo kag-email, mo direct na siya dito sa imuhang computer. No? So, Okay na, different IP address. Diligyo siya dapat magkaparehas. Okay. Pag nagkaparehas ang IP address, dili ma-deliver ang message or ang ano. Okay. So, the main function of protocols. No? So, we have five functions. Main functions of protocols. First is identify errors. No? Compromising, uh, compressing the data. This Deciding how the data should be sent, addressing the data, deciding how to announce, set, and relieve data. Okay. So, different uh, definition and terms. So, TCP IP. TCP IP stands for Transmission Control Protocol or Internet Protocol. So, protocol has become a dominant standard of internet working. So, ICTP IP represent a set of public standards specify how packets of information are exchanged between computers over one or more networks. Okay, next. Hypertext transfer protocol governs how files, chats, text, graphics, and video are changed on the World Wide Web. The external, the Internet Engineering Task Force. Develop the standards for HTTP. Okay, no, so HTTP stands for Hypertext Transfer Protocols. No? Okay, next. Uh, Kani HTTP kasagaran mapansin niyo ni sa website. Iba HTTPS, Facebook.com. So, yun na na. So, next is FTP. Sige. Sa grupo nila, Yamela, kisa makabasa. Wait lang, sir. FTP. Uh, FTP. <laughs> file transfer protocol provides services for file transfer and mani manipulation. FTP allows multiple simultaneous connection to remote file system. Okay, very good. No? So, next. So, IP addressing. So, an IP address is a number that is used to identify a device on the network. So, kung mapansin ninyo, pag nata sa network, di ba? 192.168.1.1. Uh, 
ang isa, that two, ang next is that three. So, dili siya pwede na magkaparepareyas. No, mura lang kung nagtao, dapat na ay mga sip, ano ba, uh, iba-ibang fingerprints, iba-ibang pangalan, iba-ibang apelido. So, inanap po si IP address sa computer. Okay, so, each device on a network must have a unique IP address to communicate with other network devices. Network devices are those that move data across network including hubs, switch, and routers. On a LAN host, each host device that sends and receives information on a network no, ang, and network device must have an IP address within the same network to be able to communicate each other. So, maunang uban, pag nag-IP, uh, nag-ping ka, fail ang imuhang ping. Kaya ito nga, dili siguro siya magkatugma ang ilahang IP address, no? Ibig sabihin, parehas, kunyari parehas, or na mali ka o, ano, 192.168, di ba? Tapos ang mga butang, 192.168.254. So, dili na siya magkita. So, dapat parehas itong tatlo, tapos ang ikaupat is iba-iba na. Okay. Next. Subnet mask. Okay, pakibasa kinsa sa grupo ni Yami lagi hapon. Lahi na pod magbasa. Subnet mask. The subnet mask indicates the network portion of an IP address. Like the IP address, the subnet mask is the that is a dotted decimal number. Usually, all hosts within a LAN use the same subnet mask. Table, table 3 shows default subnet mask for usable IP addresses that map to the first three classes of IP addresses. Okay, no? so mauni siya ang table 3. So, ang, ang subnet ni siya is 255.000 no so class A so naatay three classes class B and class C naapo na sa inyo hang module no so ilahi na lang natin ano sana okay next is IP configuration or IP IP config so is a command used to find out the IP address of a certain network that are connected to you are connected to di ba kung napansin niyo last last year no nag nag IP IP address mo ani di ba IP config no so how to use the IP config command so first click on the start button then type cmd no command prompt on each own search box next a black screen will appear as shown is the figure below no makita ninyo na mao na mo gawas pag pindot ninyo sa start button then next type IP config and Press enter. So, kung makita ninyo, mauna siya. Naana siya ay kompleto. IP, uh, wireless LAN, Ethernet adapter. No? So, tanan. So, the information from this window will be useful because it shows the IP address, submas, and default gateway of the network you are connected to. So, importante yun na. Okay, next is ping. Ping is a command from command used to test the ability to source of computer to reach specified designation destination of computer. So the ping command usually used as a simple way to defy, uh, verify the computer and can communicate over the network another computer to the device. So kung mapansin ninyo, last year, di ba, nagpabuhat ko og, um, straight through and crossover. Di ba, ginaping pa nato kung para matest na to kung ang atuang ato ang computer is ay ato ang gibuhat na LAN is kanang ga function okay so muna so using the ping command okay so first click the start button then type cmd then a black screen will appear and show the figure oh katong picture ganina so type the ping follow by the ip address you desire to verify okay so mao ni ang picture so makita niyo sa first illustration no 192.168.1.50 so sa picas pod is 192.2 oh dili kay parehas no dapat 192.168.1.51 so magkita na sila so inana ang 
ang ato ang IP no or pag ping. Okay. Question. Any question? Wala. Sakto lang. Wala. Next, no. Configure static and dynamic IP address. So mao na siya tong sa video ganina, no. So how to configure? So pwede niyo na i-screenshot or i-check i isulat no so first go to start button control panel can koray na lagi mong kuya diri payot okay so next network and sharing center the network sharing window appears And step two, click the view status of the local area network. The local area connection status will appear. So number three, click properties, then local area connector properties. Then click internet protocol version 4 or TCP IPv4. No? So component and click properties. So mag-appear itong internet protocol version na... Uh, Ano, so, kaniyang mo gawas. Okay. So, step 5. Click the the use of the following IP address selection button and the center, enter the following information appropriate text boxes. So, sa ato a, ah, for example, ang atong client 192.168.0.1. The next na to na workstation is 192.168.0.2 or 20. So, Ang subnet na to is automatic siya na mag 255-255-2550. Okay? So, mauna siya ang pagbuhat ng static IP address. Okay. So, question. Sige, paminaw. Nakoy question. Pag kani ako ibutang, 192.168, kay workstation 1 ha? Imagine na ninyo. Kung ako ibutang is 192.168.1.10. Tapos si workstation 2 is 192.168.0.20. Ang question ako, makit, magkita ba sila or dili? Magkita. Magkita. O. Oh. Kitsa pa. Sa grupo ni, ano, grupo nila Unggal. Uy, asa naman to? So, dili sila magkita, no? Kay nga naman. Kay sa imuhang ano, is mali na daan. 192.168.0.10 tapos sa workstation 2 ni mo 192.168.1.20. So, dili pwede. So, dapat kasi sila tatlo is magkaparehas gito sila dapat. Kana tatlo. No, pag nagwan gani diri, dapat nagwan po kadiri sa taas para magkita sila. Okay, nakuha? Para parehas. Yes, sir. Okay. Sige. So, how to configure dynamic IP address? Okay. So, same procedure, no? At tugyapon ka sa start button, control panel, network and sharing center, then click view status of local area connection, then properties, then IPv or TCP IPv4, then, next step is click obtain IP address. So, nai button dira sa taas na portion dira, no Obtain IP address. Okay. Kano sa ta magamit og obtain? Kung tahay na alang ka o ikaw lang isa sa imuhang or duha lang mo sa imuhang computer or sa imuhang workstation, duha lang. So, pwede ang isa naka-obtain ang isa na ay, na ay uh, naka static no kay automatic naman pag diingon tag obtain automatic na siya ang muhatag og IP address okay so mao na ang purpose ni obtain okay so question any question May question? Wala. So, pas-pas lang ba kayo? Or okay lang? Wala. 
Okay, sige. So na ako yung video ipakita sa inyo ha. Para ma-imagine ninyo kung kung saan siya. No? So mao ni akong i-upload kanina na video. So pwede ninyo ni siya i-reference kung na may computer diha na pang-practice ninyo. No? Sige. Okay. So mauto siya ang pagbuhat o ay pag-configure og IP address sa Windows 7. Okay? So kung makita ninyo sa video, um, sa video is na ay two ways in configuring IP address. First is dito ka sa control panel and the second is sa uh, uh, system tray. Okay? Pag ningon system tray katugong nasa ubos na makita tong mga Uh, network connection okay so mao lang ang inyong ano okay so mag-focus gyud ta diri kay sa assessment no diha gyud siya mag ano tanan no pati ang server ana mo mo agi man gyud sa network pag dili ka maka-print magsa ka sa assessment eh no so kailangan gyud nato mag-focus diha no so kamo bi ang graduating so kailangan Maka-focus mo Any question? Question? Wala na, sir. Okay. So, balik ta sa module na lang. Last, ano na to ni Then, okay na to. Dali lang man di. Ay, kayo. Okay, sa so wala pa nakakuha og module, no? Please secure module. Natay tatlo ka module, no? Good for module 1, good for 2 weeks, no? Week 1 and 2. Module 2, week good for 2 weeks kaya po. Ah, uh, ano siya? Week 2 and 3. Then module 3. Ah, uh, week 5 and 6, no? So Okay, so mao ni ato ang module. So gingon na nako ganina, same lang gihapon. Naagi hapon siya pre-assessment, then lesson proper. So gisa-isa na mo dai nato ni ganina no. So pag ano ang answer is ibutang lang sa yellow pad. Okay? So Nayo bandera na wala. Hindi na sa ano sir. 
Bilhin na sa Mujol. Kaya Mujol, ibilhin daw sa inyo ang Mujol. Okay? So, mauna ni ato ang... Ano? Any question? Sa network configuration. Next meeting, we will discuss um, kaning... Next meeting, we discuss na ito niyo. Yan eh. Ah, Ano sa tawag gani? Uh, static IPv4 configuration into 7. Then we will also discuss kaning home group configuration in Windows 7, network location profiles. No? So, paano mag-change of name sa computer? So, mauna na itong discuss. And katong oh, sige ulit. ulit. I-discuss na lang ako. Para next meeting, mo discuss na lang taog uh, networking. Okay, kung napansin ninyo, Dre, 192.168.1.1, dapat sa PCAS po, this, 192.168.1.100, okay, and then, ano mo ni kanina sa video, no? home group configuration, so, sige, pakibasa daw, ano, isa ni, Yong alamang. Wala. Oko, kasi yung pakibasa na lang ano yung home group configuration. So next ano magano kung video ana. Sige. A new option. A new option which was introduced with Windows 7 is home group. Home group allows Windows 7 machines to be linked in a easier way which makes the sharing of resources between machines much simpler to set up. Each ma ma machine must become a, a member of home group in order to utilize this functionality. The first thing that must be done on the first computer use is the creation of a home group. This is done through the choose home group and sharing option in the network and sharing center window. Okay, no. Apa ah, kibasa pa ni? Okay, sige. Yong alamang, pakibasa na lang. Once this option is selected, the home group window is displayed. The first computer to be configured with a home group will be given the option to create a, a home group. <coughs> Once a home group is configured on a network, it was ac activity broadcast its existence to the other computers on the network. Home group requires IPv6 to be en enabled. Once a, group, uh, once a home group has been created on a network, all other participating computers must join it in order to join the home group. Okay, so... Ang ato ang OS na siya pinakadali na para makonek no. So through home group, okay? So asa siya makita. Mm. Kana oh, sa mga work group or group niya ipangalanan pa nimo. Okay. So kana home group. Next, Windows 7 network location or profile. So, pag nag, ano na ka sa network ni mo na yung mga mugawas, no? Homework network, work network, and public network. So, mas kaasa lang liha yung mga, ano, no? Next, no, how to change the name of your Windows computer. So, kani siya sa assessment, ginapachange po na sa assessor. Okay? Mungingon siya, okay, pangalani ang imuhang PC1 as client, as server, then isut. PC to as client. So, here are three routes you can take to open up system properties. First is to type SY SDM CPL into start menu search box. No? Uh, search box. Pinaka dali. 
or right click on computer option then start menu in my computer okay so open control panel and go to system maintenance and system so mauna ni siya mo gawas pag nakita ninyo na click advanced system settings so pag naklik ka ng advanced system settings mo gawas na ni then click change button to rename the computer and it will with it will pop up the dialog no so mauna ni i change ni mo so instead of work buta na to work group no uh, butang ba ni mo home uh, uh, ano ba siya sa ba dams inana so depende sa imo ang work group kung sa server na po ta mag connection na po ta about server so domain sa domain ta mo add to pero kung ano lang wala tay server agian so pwede ta sa work group okay so now you can finally change your computer also change the name of your work groups something more descriptive as well you have the reboot after you make change okay so addressing in networking so mauna na siya tong ip address no then what is ip address so ip address is internet protocol address is a unique address that is computing devices as, as personal computers tablets used to identify itself to communicate with other ip network so mac address is assigned as a host network interface card it is also known as physical address okay so ip address classes so naatay class a class b class c class d class e so mao ni siya ang mga range sa ato ang class no 1 1 2 6 no so mao na subnet discuss ato ganina naatay class a class b class c and class d so how to call ip config so kanina we discuss po dato ganina ang mga command sa pag ip configuration Okay. So how to share files and folder over the network. Next meeting we will discuss how uh, sharing of files and folder over the network. So himuan pa nato na siyang video next week. No? So ina na. So in your activity 1.7 network configuration, so malamang ano ni siya uh, hands on. No, so kailangan na to crossover cable and two computer sets. Pag naana tay face to face, himuan na to niya ni. No? So ana. Activity 1.8 configure internet NIC no to use the HCP. Okay. Okay, any question? So, maula na ito ang module karon Next meeting, i-discuss na ito sharing of folders. No, Mag-imot ang video, Ana. Para mas dali. Asa naman ito? Question. Question sa module. Wala. Wala.